hi guys and welcome back to my channel if you're new here hello hello my name is Oge, but my pen name is Nedi, which is a nickname gotten from my middle name Nedima because some people have been asking so um first of all i would want to apologize for the shaky camera of the video that is coming very soon this is my first time actually recording it was hard and yeah so please bear with me for now hopefully the remaining videos will be better okay so for today's video i decided to do a meet the artist because why not like most of you know me but you don't really know the artist side of me so i decided hey why not do a midi artist for the first video and in case some of you don't know what the midi artist is it's a instagram hashtag where artists like myself draw themselves and add like likes dislikes and some other fun stuff and it's really cool really exciting and it makes you get to like know yourself a little bit more and let your followers like know you a little bit more so i was like you know what that's the perfect thing to use as the speed paint for the background while you hear me ramble about my myself so yeah i decided to do this because the last midi edits i did was around 2017 i think and honestly that one is crappy now and very outdated so i decided to make a, an updated version and i would put the 2017 one on the screen right now for you to see so yeah you can see how outdated and copy it is so this is a time lapse of the updated version that i just did and i'll be posting on my instagram later today so if you want to see the full version out it's going to be at the end of this video but if you want to like take your time and really look at it it's up my instagram by now so yeah okay so what i want to say is i want to just use this video to briefly like tell you a short introduction about myself why i decided to start this youtube and what you can expect from this youtube channel so first of all you already know my name my name is ogechuku nedima okafo and i am 19 and i'll be turning 20 next month and it's the scariest thing like just thinking about it scares me sometimes but we go on life moves on you have to grow such is life anyways i'll be turning 20 next month so that means i'm born in june and that means i'm a gemini so shout out to all my gemini brothers and sisters out there you know we're the best don't let anyone tell you otherwise okay i am a gryffindor if you're a potter more head like harry potter yep you know i'm a gryffindor and also my favorite color if by now you literally cannot tell is pink i am an absolute girly girl i love everything pink glitter flowers anything that has this ethereal feel that you can just find me there okay so basically why did i decide to start this youtube channel oh no let me start from what got me into art initially so i've been drawing for as long as i remember i started drawing in my year six of primary school but i started taking art seriously in my year 10 yes because that was when i found out that you can actually do art for a living and i was like what like for some reason it didn't click to me that all the animation i watched that people actually get paid to do that for some reason i just assumed it was impossible so yeah finding out was like a huge like breaking point for me i was like i need to do art for a living like that is pay me to draw like yes please <laughs> so i decided to start taking art seriously then and i started digital art in 2017 i believe yes i got this yes 2017 may of 2017 i was in my final year i was writing my final exams and i said digital art i am self-taught basically in digital arts um the first app i used to learn digital art was adobe illustrator yes on the on my ipad mini back then and the only video that helped me was actually a video by a, a senior from my secondary school and her name is Data Peppo. she's also an artist, please check out her art, it's amazing. She's also a YouTuber here on YouTube and honestly she was one of my biggest inspirations. She had a YouTube video back then, it's taken down now because she's rebranding her channel and everything. But she had a YouTube video back then and it was, it had a video on how to use adobe illustrator and that was literally the only video i watched that helped me learn digital art so yeah shout out to data thank you so much that your video was it literally is what got me to where i am today 
okay so basically i sell in digital art in 2017 and i fell in love with it and in i used adobe illustrator for the longest time i used that to get myself familiar with the app then in 2018 i really can't remember i think it was either late 2017 or mid 2018 i think it was mid 2018 i got procreate and that's what i've been using since then and honestly i love it procreate is like amazing and yeah um i got my ipad pro in 20 late 2018 mm, or early 2019 i can't remember but i got my ipad pro and my apple pencil around that time and then it just made the whole process better for me and ever since then i have been teaching myself how to draw and it's been a blast so let me tell you guys why i decided to start this youtube channel so i've always wanted to start a youtube channel for a very very long time like i said um i either i didn't know what it would be about i thought maybe it would be about fashion because i do love fashion then i thought maybe it would be lifestyle or maybe it would be anime based because i love anime and i thought maybe it would be cool to like make a youtube channel where i did anime reviews and stuff but then after a while i talked to my friends and then i realized that None of those are my passion. As much as I love anime, I don't want to like sit in front of a microphone talking about my favorite anime character. By the way, that's Kirishima. All day long, wow. And get nothing out of it. I want something to be able to push me to do what I love, which is creating art. And then I decided to start an art YouTube, which is where we are today. So lately, and by lately I mean since November last year I have been in an ongoing off and on art block and I haven't been producing any new arts like any completed pieces I've just been like doodling or deceiving myself that I'm studying and we both know I'm not I'm just trying to avoid actually making complete art and that is honestly not what's best for me right now especially because i am almost graduating from college and after graduation i plan on chasing my dreams and careers and if i am nowhere near industry level i am not going to get a job and i don't want to be complaining while i can be practicing right now so i decided to make, make this channel to you know make myself accountable and if i have to post art youtube videos i would have to post art and if i had to post art i would have to create art therefore i have to draw whether i like it or not at least study so here are some of the things you can expect from my youtube channel i plan on doing things like drawing me studies sketching me and maybe the occasional vlogs um q a's and Maybe some streams. I like I like the idea of streams. And also some other random art related videos. We'll see as we go. Like I just have a lot of like ideas. And honestly, I'm open for more ideas. If you have any idea, please leave it down in the comments below. So basically the video is about to end. It's rounding up. It's just the right now I am going to begin the um adding the extra fun parts. I just finished drawing myself. Yes, that is supposed to be me. Um, I think I think I captured my essence a little bit, the pink lips, and uh, I think I captured it a bit. So yeah, here I'm just drawing the like what's in my bag and some other fun stuff. So you can just enjoy the process. Thank God the shaky video t um, time lapse is over, so you guys have a steady like you know you can enjoy the process right now. Honestly, I am so 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 thankful for all the support I have gotten so far. I never expected to get like that many like comments or likes or subscribers in one day from one video one one minute video I thought people would be like this is too short or something but honestly I'm so grateful thank you guys so much I hope like you enjoy my content like cuz as much as I want to like enjoy editing videos and posting videos I want you guys to also enjoy them I don't want to just do this so yes thank you so much Hopefully, the next video will be up by Monday next week, and then you guys can tune in to see that one. So, for now, thank you for watching, and see you next time. Bye!